Today we're working on our 92 F-150 and we're having a no start issue. Um, so this is what happens when you put the key in and turn it on. It doesn't, it doesn't even spin the starter or anything. All the lights just come on and it buzzes. So if I leave the key on in the run position, so I have the key in the on position as you can hear because I left the door open. Um, and then I also have the truck in neutral. Um, so I have a, a wire just running from the positive terminal of the battery over to the starter relay. Um, this sense comes from inside the cab. Um, it's It gets a 12 volt signal when the, um, the clutch neutral safety switch and the ignition switch both sense that either it's not in gear and you have the clutch engaged or the key is turned to the end of the key is turned to the run position. So if I pop this off and just touch this with 12 volts, the truck starts up. So, so that tells me that it's either the ignition switch or it's this clutch neutral safety switch. Um, I know it's this because I heard it crack the other day when I pushed the clutch in. But um, if you have one of these repair manuals, it shows you how you can check the ignition switch. Um, right here, it tells you like the continuity. There should be continuity between you know these different sets of pins in these different switch positions. Um, but I'll show you how to replace this clutch neutral safety switch. So once you're under your dash, um, this is your, right, right here, that's your clutch neutral safety switch. And then this is your, this white or cream colored box here, this is your uh, ignition control. Um, and you can get to it by taking this lower dash bezel off, which is just two bolts. And then there's two more bolts here, here, and one on the other end for the actual module itself. All right, let's see if I can do this one handed while holding the camera so you guys can see. It's pretty straightforward, but sometimes you do need two hands. Uh, so you just take a little flathead, pop this electrical clip down, that comes down like that, and then go up on the sides on the, the top cover here, and it's on both sides, which might be hard to, hard to reach with one hand. Okay, so that, that comes off like that. And then there's just one little tab here on the bottom holding it in. So you just pull that down. And uh, uh, let's see if I can pull it down and pull it back. So that comes off like that. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below.